How's it going? Welcome to the video. My name is Jean, spelled like Jean. If you know that, you might speak French, or you might have been here before. If you don't know that, you're probably new, and welcome to the video. Welcome to the channel. So glad to have you here. It's a party all the time. I've got an exciting video for you guys. Today's kind of a special day for one reason, maybe two, maybe a whole bunch of reasons. It's special because today, 7-Eleven, free Slurpee day in America. That's, I don't know if that's true anywhere else. Two years ago to this day was the first time I ever did CrossFit. It has been a wild ride. I'll tell you that for sure. I think we should do a flashback montage. <laughs> oh my god. Um, I don't even know. I still... <laughs> Since the last time I've recorded a video, I've actually joined a new box. All right, so I did it. I finished Fran. <laughs> you got it. Yes. That workout was tough. Come with me. Well, that was fun. I hope uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If I decide in post when I'm editing to actually go through with this, or if I decide to be like, yeah, it's not, we'll, we'll see. It's been two years today. After my first CrossFit workout, I remember 7-Eleven for one specific reason. After my first CrossFit workout, um, I went to 7-Eleven and got a free Slurpee because I figured I'd deserve it. Anyway, what I'm hoping to do right now, I'm at work, I just clocked out for my lunch break, I'm hoping to get about 20-ish minutes of jump rope in because I have learned and I realize jump rope is awesome. Like more than just double unders and when you only think about singles and doubles it's pretty boring but when you start moving your feet when you got some music in your ear and you got a nice BPM to kind of go with it ends up being like a lot of fun and it ends up being like a real good sweat, a real good workout, it's like running a mile, it's like doing whatever, but you're listening to music and you're, it's almost like a dance with it. And I'm white, and I don't have rhythm, so I get it, I don't have a dance, but I'm trying trying to get better at that, like the freestyle type of jump rope. The only problem is there's someone in the gym right now, we have an RX like athlete in the gym, and they're doing their workout, and I don't wanna bother them, and I actually shouldn't go bother them, so, I'm gonna have to do this workout outside, which isn't a problem. It means I get to work on a tan, I get to work on jumping out, I'm working on getting shredded and tan and looking good for summer. Let's work out. Here are a few benefits to jumping rope. One of the first benefits to jumping rope is gonna be obvious. By jumping, by moving, by sweating, you're burning calories. So it's a good way to switch up going on Stairmaster, going on the rower, running, which is so boring, these mono structural tasks that you just kind of zone out on. This one's good because like I said, you got, a, you got a beat you're going to, you're just dancing along, you're jumping along, and while you're doing that, you are burning calories. And it's a good way, if you're looking at weight loss, you know, working on getting more of a um, sculpted physique, this is gonna help you with that. The second thing is that it is going to increase your cardio. Now, if you're doing it in spurts, like let's just say you're doing 30 seconds on, 10 seconds off, or you're doing, you know, 10 seconds on, 30 seconds, whatever. If you're doing these intervals and you're doing them at high intensity, that's gonna work on your anaerobic base, which is gonna help you explode in your workouts. If you're just steadily jumping rope over a long period of time, um, this is gonna help your aerobic capacity and that's gonna allow you to do longer in those 20 minute, 30 minute time domains when you feel like you just wanna give up. Jumping rope is gonna help you in those workouts. And then um, the third thing I would say is that it's just more fun. It's a more fun method of exercise than structural, mono, 
moving at a single pace for X amount of time. Um, like I said, you put a good dance track on, you put a good fast BPM and you go with it, um, that you're gonna have a lot more fun and you're still burning all those calories and you're still working on your anaerobic or aerobic base. So if you are not incorporating jump rope, and I'm not just talking about CrossFit double unders, I mean, whatever, having fun with it, moving your feet, getting better, working on that hand-eye coordination. Um, if you're not already doing that in your training, I highly recommend adding that to your repertoire. It's lunchtime, so I'm gonna eat now. Some days, you just have all the bags. I got a lot of bags today, but we're off work, and we're going to the gym, like I said, it's that 530 grind. Um, I gotta spend the entire time mobilizing. Ooh, it is bright. That's better. I gotta spend the whole time mobilizing because today we have hang, squat, snatch, and that is not. Like my body was built a certain way, and it seems to be the exact way that hang, squat, snatches. Bows. Yesterday at CrossFit, we did 90 bar facing burpees. That's about 90 more than is necessary. Welcome to the video commentary of this uh, workout. I don't do these often, but I, when I do voiceovers and commentaries, I really like to do video ones, because then you guys get to see like my movements and what I do, and I feel like a big part of me is my hands and face. Today's um, strength section, then it was two hang squat snatches, one below the knee, one above the knee. I ended up getting up to 140, which I'm okay with. Um, I didn't really have like a big number as long as I hit over 135, and I got two, two and a half plates over that. So that was what I ended up getting for that skill snatch section. The Metcon section of the workout was 21.15.9 handstand push-ups with an 80-foot overhead uh, walking lunge with a 45-pound plate. I ended up getting like 9.25. I was hoping I'd be able to break up my handstand push-ups into seven 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 five 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 four. It didn't end up working that way. Um, your shoulders just blown up. I fell off the wall a couple times, but I'm satisfied with my time. I pushed myself on those lunges to just go as fast as I could. Um, all in all, you can't you can't get mad at that. You know, I did the best I could do today with this workout, and that's what I ended up at. So I'm happy. I'm cool with that. But with that, uh, I think I'm gonna end the video today. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, please like it. If you wanna leave a comment, I will try to somewhat respond to you. Um, and if you're not already subscribed, subscribe because we have a fun time here. Good times roll consistently and constantly and covenantly.